I'm Elisha Hale from Mission 2819. I'm sitting here with Jeffrey Pitts, more well known as JP, who's one of the performers. He's going to be performing June 27th at the Indiana Farmers Coliseum here in Indianapolis. And we're just really looking forward to what the Lord's going to do here. Really looking forward to seeing lives get hooked into the one that can transform them from darkness to light. Man, tell me, where did you start? Man, I started uh, well, actually just doing music out of my, my dad's house. And was, you know, a, a victim of drugs and alcohol. Grew up in a broken home, in and out of jails, rehab centers. The Lord came to me, touched my heart, and completely renewed me. I used to do uh, regular street rap, gangster rap, man, but the Lord spoke to me and said, it's time for you to use that gift for me. Amen. Now, how long have you been walking with the Lord? Uh, about seven years. Okay, that's awesome. Every day it just gets better, right? On fire every day. Now, I want to know about your involvement with Mission 2819. I know Rob Hovermill is the one who's putting this all on. He's getting everything connected. And what point did you come on with Mission 2819? And what was it about this, this mission that, that said, yeah, I want to be part of this? Well, man, he just, uh, you know, he, he, it's like the Lord just brought us both together. He was working at a recreation center for the youth. And I came and performed there, did some ministry there for the youth. And he said, man, you got to come on board because, see, I was a troubled youth. So that's my heart. These kids are my heart. This this vision is my heart. That vision is my vision. And you know, uh, if if I had people in my life at their age yeah. that spoke to me like we're gonna do them, I would have never, probably never, would have ended up going to jail and getting guns put to my head and getting robbed and robbing people and overdosing and etc. So yeah, that's the thing that uh, really spoke to my heart is that there's so many performers here who have had their lives changed by Jesus in the past, and that they get an opportunity to give that out to multiply, to be fruitful and to multiply to that testimony. You know, even the word testimony means do it again. Mm -hmm. And so I'm just super excited to be a part of the whole Mission 2819 family. And, you know, we're going to be dealing with youth that are being abused, youth that don't have food on the weekends because the school where they get their only meals are shut down. Man, what is something that experience in your life, a thing that you used to struggle with, or just some habit that a lot of people say, man, I could never be free of this. What is just one of the biggest things that you have seen yourself come through because of your relationship with the Lord? An addiction to drugs and pornography. Amen. Amen. God, had, uh, you know, I, growing up on the streets, you, you, you live that life. It's, it becomes normal to you to uh, embrace sexual perversion yeah. and drugs and alcohol and, and, and that of the sort, but that was a big battle for me, uh, to battle the flesh, but when you let go and quit trying to do it on your own, Amen. and you let Jesus have his way, then he, the blood will break every chain. Amen. Now you're a pastor also, along with being a, a rapper and a lyricist and a musician, you're also a pastor. Where are you a pastor at here? Uh, I pastor at the Upper Room in Mars Hill. Uh, towards like Kentucky and Holt area, it's a it's a pretty rough neighborhood. It's full of, uh, of troubled youth. This is perfect, yeah. Because we're actually in revival right now, and for Mission Twenty Eight Nineteen to come up on board, and then we want to throw the whole Mars Hill in the vision. Amen. Amen. And, and let's transform a city, a nation, Amen. transform the planet. Amen. Make a city a lighthouse and go from there. That's it. And you know, your music is available online. Your your CD is apps available on iTunes. It's available. You can find it on Reverb Nation. I'm sure. You're find clips of it on YouTube and it's called Without Religion. When did you put this out? Well, Without Religion, I've had it out for about a, a year and a half, uh, going on two years. I just, it, the vision for it, man, was just basically without religion. It is fully Jesus. It is fully spirit. It, it, it goes and it penetrates the deepest hearts of the broken man. You know, you can get it, you, like you said, you can get it on Spotify, Google Music, uh, you know, just wherever God leads you. you give me a testimony. Tell me just real briefly a story where you've seen your music touch somebody's life and seen their life just be impacted by the music alone. Man, it's crazy. You get you get thugs on the street, uh, uh, young kids who are lost. They end up getting the music, and then they feel the, the heart. It, it puts out a positive image, of course. And then, like, I've had people come to me, and they'll send clips to my Facebook where they're driving down the street bumping my music. And they were bumping, you know, uh, uh, old music, old gangster rap and, and, and thug music. But now they, they, there's a beat to something that penetrates the spirit and not just the soul. you got a lot of people in your church, actually, that come from uh, wrecked environments, come from ruined families. And you've got to see them trans 
formed and just walk as new creations. And we were talking about that. It was amazing when I heard about it. Has your, have you seen your music? Did that open the door to a lot of those relationships? Oh, yeah. They're, really? they're all, they're every time, every day, bring me a CD, bring me a CD. Yeah. They're in the neighborhood. They, they, uh, uh, they're putting speakers out in front of their house, and they're turning it on. You serious? And it's just pounding through the neighborhood. That's awesome. Man. Sending shockwaves of glory. <laughs> I love it, man. I love it. All right, well, man, don't miss, don't miss Jeffrey Pitts, June 27th at the Indiana Farmers Coliseum. It's going to be an amazing day with Mission 2819. Spoken word, rappers, rock bands, worship bands. It's going to have it all be there. 